Welcome to a ViewSonic unboxing. My name is Ray, and today for you I have a VX2768 2K PC MHD. Now that's quite a bit uh, a long part number, uh, but what you need to know about this is that this is part of our VX series, which is sort of our premium line of home monitors, but also it marks our entry level gaming monitors, and this is one of those such monitors. Now this has what I would consider sort of a Goldilocks spec, in that this is a Quad HD display, and it's 144. Uh, Hertz refresh rate with AMD premium support as well. So uh, let's get it open and I'll get into some of those spec details as well. All right, now removing the outer box, the first thing that uh, we'll see here is actually some of the cabling as well as the stand. So let's get this open. This right here is a U-shaped piece. It's actually the base of the stand for the monitor. Uh, we'll set that off to the side for now. Uh, this piece uh, is actually the upright for the stand. We have some basic documentation. We have our power. This model actually is nice because it's got a built-in power supply, so no external power brick, and a display port cable, as well as a few tools that you'll need to assemble everything. Pulling off the top here, we can pull out our panel itself. If I pause right here for a second, you can see there's actually a pretty significant curve to this display. This display actually has what's called a 1500R uh, radius to it. So what that means is, is if this panel were to continue until it was a full circle, it would have a 1.5 meter radius. Uh, and the smaller the number, the tighter the radius of the monitor, and basically the more immersive the experience. So on some of our professional level uh, monitors, we tend to go with like an 1800R, uh, which is a little bit shallow curve. But when you go gaming, we go a little bit more uh, deeply curved because it's a more immersive gaming experience. So let's get it assembled. I'm going to lay our monitor down here. And here's just the base uh, of the stand. What's nice about it is we do try to make these as toolless as possible. So um, you can tighten this on with the screwdriver, but you can actually just uh, finger tighten it as well, and that'll work perfectly fine. And we do include uh, a little Phillips head screwdriver in the box um, because there are four screws you'll want to attach here on the back of the base. You can see the base is actually already supporting the weight of the monitor head uh, without any screws in it, and that's perfectly fine. Structurally, you're not causing any damage or anything. Okay, now here the monitor is fully assembled. And uh, you can see the, the tight radius curve of this, some of the cool features of this monitor. So I spoke before that it actually has an AMD premium uh, designation. Now, what does that mean? Uh, in order to get AMD FreeSync premium support, uh, what you actually have to do is you have to have a panel that can do more than 120 hertz, or at least 120 hertz. Uh, this one, again, is a native 144 hertz panel, uh, as well as it needs to have what's called LFC, or low frame rate compensation. What that means is, is that the monitor has to be able to handle a scenario where your graphics card is no longer outputting, uh, of, say, a full 60 hertz signal. So in the case of this monitor, it'll actually synchronize to your graphics card down to about 48 frames per second. So if you're not able to maintain that 60 FPS, the monitor will sync down to about 48 and stay frame to frame accurate with your graphics card so that you don't notice any differences or juddering or screen tearing because you're not at the full 60 FPS. Uh, however, most of the time you're gaming, you're probably going to be well above that anyways. Uh, you're going to get the best gaming experience running this thing at the full 144 hertz. Um, another cool feature on this thing, uh, we've tried to move away as much as possible from really fiddly, uh, hard to use buttons for the menu. So we went to a full joystick design uh, that has four-way movement as well as push in and out. Um, as far as connectivity, uh, this is really nice for those of you who do PC gaming, where it's got a full DisplayPort 1.4 as well as two HDMI 2.0 ports. So feel free to hook up your graphics card to this from your uh, desktop computer, uh, maybe an HDMI from your laptop, and then an HDMI from a gaming uh, console and have them all connected at the same time 
with the full support of this monitor. So other things on the screen specs, uh, this is an MVA panel. So this has a native 3000 to one contrast ratio, about three times what you would get from an IPS. And it is a full 2560 by 1440 Hertz panel. So this has just been a quick unboxing and overview of the VX2768 2K PC MHD. Uh, please watch this space for more exciting unboxings and videos from ViewSonic.